Hey folks, someone asked me recently about how to make a fist and my response to them was uh, close your hand. You know, I didn't, I didn't really have much to offer. And, uh, but I thought about it for a little bit and I did have a, a couple things that I, that I thought I could offer, um, especially if you're, you know, new to, new to combat sports. Um, when you make a fist, you want to keep that thumb on the outside of your fingers. All right. You may, you may think you want to hide it in, in your palm, but on, as you can see on impact, it's a good way to break your thumb. So one thing, simple way you could practice this is open close. Just making sure that that thumb ends up on the outside of your closed fingers. Now, as far as shadow boxing and mitt work, sparring, uh, a lot of people like to do it with their hands open, right? Like to keep their hands in an open, relaxed position. Um, some people will suggest to you to keep your hands open inside the glove so your hands are faster that way. And, uh, you know, that's all fine. Um, for me, I like to keep a, a closed fist loose but still closed and um one of the reasons is and you know the saying we we compete the way we practice if i if i'm gonna compete with my hands and a fist and if i'm gonna punch with a fist then i like to practice with my hands closed right but i think more importantly is if i'm in the habit of doing these things with my hands closed and if i'm not great measuring distance or range or something unexpected happens the bag moves closer to me than i imagine my opponent the mitt and i make contact with any one of those things with an open hand before i can have time to close my fist on impact then obviously that can be very problematic so as a practical suggestion especially if you're new I suggest keeping your hands in a loose fist. That way, if you misjudge the distance, if you step closer to the mirror than you expected, at least you're hitting it with somewhat of a fist. Okay? So, for what it's worth, there, there's my uh, video on, you know, how to make a fist. I would also suggest that you want to practice hitting with these knuckles here. When you throw your punches, you want to try to land you know, with these knuckles here, here's my thumb, this is my left hand. Now what's interesting is if you break this part of your hand and you go to the doctors, they'll call that a uh, boxer's fracture. But boxers don't hit with this part, right? They wanna hit here, so. Um, anyway, thanks for checking us out. If you like the video, thumbs up. If you don't, thumbs down, but leave comments, subscribe. You all know the drill, but uh, thanks for checking us out. We appreciate it, take care.